Today tutorial we will be going over the switchboard today but first we like to look at our menu we have one through nineteen that's our menus and this is our main screen okay this is our main screen and our main screen is just like a phone so what we and as you can see our system it will time out on you so let's log back in and we're gonna be on stall 23 so we let the cook know do not make so our cook won't make this order all right so here we have our main screen okay now this is our combo meal our kids meal our value menu our drink menu and our slushy menu now the rest of these are what we consider our hot item and our main screen is just like our phone is our home screen okay now we have a mayo burger a mustard burger a ketchup burger and a works burger now what is a works a works is everything that's on the sandwich exactly now say for instance we don't know exactly what comes on the burger we can hit works and then hit no and we hit no and that shows us everything that comes on that particular sandwich okay now we want to delete that off so we're going to highlight it red and hit item delete so let's go over our uh, combo meal right quick all right now the number one and the number two is the exact same way okay now and also you notice that our light blue is what medium and our dark blue is large all right now and then we have our yellow which is color coded if our is our breakfast okay so let's go to a number one combo and the first question that we have to ask the customer is what would you like that with mayo mustard ketchup or all the way okay. now once they say okay I don't want that with any ketchup so we can say no ketchup so they know the cook gonna make that burger as with uh, mayo and mustard no ketchup now I can ring that burger up another way I could simply say guess what uh, ketchup and mayo you see so now the easier we make it for on the screen the easier it will be for the cook to make it okay. all right then the next thing we have to do is we have to ask the question uh, would you like tops or I meant fries or tops right now I don't have to press medium because what is already medium now at any other time a customer order um, cheddar pepper my sticks onion rings then they're gonna be an upcharge if they ask for cheese fries or chili cheese fries anything like that and the system gonna indicate how much more it would be to make that uh, a chili cheese fry okay. likewise with a fountain drink now and we say that the um, drinks setting is already set on default for medium so we don't have to press medium okay. now anytime they ask for a slushy boom that's how much more it would be to make that a strawberry slush even if we make it a a blast it will cause that much more to make that a blast okay. so this is how well uh, detailed this system is it'll give you the upcharge as you ringing it up now say for instance we didn't take and we didn't make that a chili cheese fry or a blast we just did what is a combo a medium fry or top and then we say a drink so let's delete that and make that a drink then that's that total of that particular meal okay now so the number one and the number two is the exact same way so the next question is would you like that with mayo mustard ketchup all the way now say for instance they want this burger made with just ketchup only then we can hit this plain button down here mm -hmm. we hit plain and then what add ketchup fries and we say no on the top only thing we can take off the top is the salt okay that's what these buttons are for and then we have what we go back we want that burger cut in half we want that burger well done and what guess what we also want it on texas toast okay so this is what these uh modifiers are for press the button please hey somebody press the button there's too many of us in here
All right. So now the number three, it will go straight into tots or fries. Okay. Okay. So we got tots or fries, and, and then the drink. Okay. Now let's also look at these drinks, and this is something that is special about the system is that they keep it color coded, but also they put them in alphabetical order. Okay. So we see in the dark purple, we got from C C D D D F L L H I O P R Sprite, so forth and so on. Okay. So if a customer is telling you their drink, your eyes should go in that area. If they say Coke, look up. Coke is right there. Diet. Boom. They want Sprite and boom, I'm going to the end. They want water, I'm going to the end. Now, here is another color, and these are our limeades. We have a cherry limeade, a dark cherry limeade. We have a limeade, a dyed limeade, a strawberry limeade, and a dyed strawberry limeade. Now, what does uh, a diet uh, flavor, what drink would they get? Do you know? Sprite Zero. Okay. In order to make it a diet, so we said diet cherry limeade. Rather than give them Sprite, cherry. we're gonna give them Sprite Zero, okay. and then we're gonna give them the, the cherry and the lime. So therefore, we have the uh, right. diet cherry limeade. Likewise, with a, stra a diet strawberry limeade, we're gonna do Sprite Zero, strawberries and limes. Gotcha. Okay. Now, and also we still have over here we have our slush menu, we have our promo drinks, cream slushies, shakes, blasts, and then we have an arrow. And then we also have white milk and chocolate milk. Well, let's see what this arrow have on the next page. Then we have coffee, cold brew, and then we can do floats. Okay. Floats, and then what flavor float do they want? They want Coke, Dr. Pepper, Pepper. Sprite, okay. any fountain drink. But guess what? That's how much more it costs to make that a float. It's okay. seven cent more, all right? Now, the number four and the number five is the exact same way. It goes straight into the tots and the fries. Okay. But let's look at the number six. Now, the number six combo, which is this one right here, it gives you an option of what? An all-American dog and a chili cheese dog. So, the question is when a customer say, well, let me get the number six. Our question is what? Would you like American dog or chili cheese dog? Awesome sauce. Now, also on our screen, on our monitor, we have what? We have a New York dog and we have a plain hot dog and a pretzel dog. We no longer do the New York dog or the cheese pretzel. But our order system, our POS system is for nation. It's national wide. So some stores in some market area, they still make the New York dog. They still do the cheesy pretzel dog. Okay. But we only offer on our menu the American dog and okay. the chili cheese dog. So if I say I want a chili cheese hot dog with nothing on it, what would that be? That would be a plain hot dog. Oh, yeah. All right. Now, the difference if a customer say, well, let me get um, a chili cheese dog. Your question should be, would you like the number six hot dog or the number seven hot dog? Because that's chili and cheese as well. Okay. All right. So we see we have a six inch chili cheese dog and we have a foot long chili cheese dog. Now, what's the difference between the two hot dogs? This is not only six inches, but this is all beef. Okay. This is beef and pork. Okay. Okay. So when a customer says, let me get the number, uh, let me get a chili cheese dog. Say a number and guess what their eyes gonna do? They're gonna look at the menu and see which one they want. Would you like the number six or would you like the number seven? So that's how we direct them to that. Okay. So let's look at the number seven because it also gives us options on this particular item. So we have a foot long American, foot long chili cheese, foot long New York, and a foot long hot dog. This hot dog is nothing on it. It's plain. plain, right. Now we just said we don't do what? We don't do the New York dog, so we don't have to worry about that. But what hot dog do the customer see? A chili cheese. That's all they see. They don't, so you don't have to give them the option of a foot long American or a foot long chili cheese dog. Because we only going to make what is advertised. Okay. But if a customer say, well, can you make that as a foot long American? Yes, we can. Okay. Okay. So when they say, let me get a number uh, seven, automatically hit chili cheese dog. Okay. Okay. Now. Say for instance, the customer want a hot dog with just cheese on it. Never do this. Say a hot dog, add cheese. Now, 
we just charge them 60 cents. Why don't we do this? Because it's all about saving the customer and giving them the best deal. So we're going to say a foot long chili and cheese dog. We're going to say no what? Chili. Exactly. So we just save them 60 cents. So that's what we're all about. Because the money is not going in my pocket. And we want them to bring more money by giving them the best deals. Okay. Okay? So now let's look at the number eight. The number eight is what? A pop. There you go. Say it again. Jumbo popcorn chicken. Jumbo popcorn chicken. So when we say uh, popcorn chicken, we have to ask them, what size pop chicken would you like? Medium. Right. Because you can get a large, but still get a medium top and a medium drink. Right? So we find out what uh, pop chicken they want. And then we have to ask the question, what sauce? Would you like barbecue, honey mustard, or ranch? Now, I always do this when I'm training on this particular part. I want you to find the sauce on this particular menu board. Now, if you can find the sauces on this menu board under in 30 seconds, guess what? You're going to get a free meal. Okay? Oh. <laughs> now, you're looking at the pop chicken. There's the pop chicken. She's looking for pop chicken. Now, I want you to point out the sauces on this menu board. Counting at 30, 29. 28. Wait, right here? 20, uh -huh. It's on the menu board. 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, positive, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, huh? I'm counting down. 10, 9, 8, the, the sauces. Six. Right here? Eight. Five. Oh, she found it. All right. Look. Eight seconds. Huh? Okay. Right. Now, great job. You get you a free meal today. Okay. <laughs> but it took you 29 seconds to find out where the sauces is. True. So, we don't want it to take that long. So, therefore, that's why we're going to say, what sauce would you like? Barbecue, honey mustard, or ranch? We want to go ahead and close that time frame of taking the order ordering process. Okay. Okay. Now, and if you just say what type of sauce they're going to offer, they're going to ask for something off the wall. You got sweet and sour. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Do you got uh, buffalo cheese? What is that? Uh, blue cheese. We The only sauce we carry is this. Buffalo, I'm sorry, barbecue, barbecue honey mustard, and ranch. Okay. Now, we do have a special sauce called the signature sauce, okay. which is honey mustard and barbecue mixed yeah. together. Right. So, if they want signature sauce, we just hit no sauce and we make sure we put it in the bag. Okay. Now, at the top of the screen, it's showing you what? Choose three, three options. So you have to select this three to go on to the next step. So we press barbecue three times. So then the next question is what? Do you want five tots? Okay. We want tots. Yeah. Next question. What do you want? What's your drink? What would you like to drink? Boom. And there it is. And there's our combo. Now, that's our pop chicken. Now, number nine, number ten is the same exact way. It goes straight into tots of fries. Okay. Now, the number eight and then the number eleven is similar. We have to ask what size. So we want the number eleven. We want a dinner. What is our question to the customer? Would you like a three piece or a five piece? All right. Now, these tots, these uh, dinners, they come with a medium tot or a fry one single onion ring and one single slice of toast okay. okay that is what consists of a dinner so they want a three-piece dinner next thing we have to ask is what what, what sauce would you like no we don't say what sauce oh, would you like barbecue, barbecue honey mustard, ranch. exactly boom now say for instance they want to uh make that into a fry so we hit add hit the second page Boom, we got fries, cheese fries, chili cheese fries, and also onion rings. Okay. This is how we sub on this particular order. All right, so that's uh, our dinner. Now, we don't do wings. I don't know why wings is still on here. They just brought that back. They didn't have this on here, so we don't do wings. Now, let's talk about our breakfast. Let's do the yellow, okay? So, on here, on our menu board, it says what? Sausage or, or what? So that's the question. If a cousin say, let me get a burrito with the number 14, bacon or sausage. Okay. Boom. Now, majority of the customer automatically want tots. Yeah, right. Tots go good with breakfast. Now, if they want other than that, 
they're gonna tell you. So I automatically just give them tots and go straight into the drink. Okay. Okay. So we did number 14. Now let's do 15. The question should be for our customers what? The Super Sonic Burrito or the Ultimate Burrito. Now, I love to train on the Super Sonic Burrito because it has so many ingredients. A lot of people don't commit this to memory, so how would I know what's in it? We're going to hit no. Press no for me. That's what comes into at burrito, except for the salsa sauce. Okay. It comes with cheese, egg, jalapenos, onion, sausage, tomatoes, and four tops. Now, this is what makes this is a, a premium burrito. It's the four tots that we put in it. Okay? The ultimate burrito is the exact same way. I'm sorry, but dinner total was 930 premium. So our ultimate burrito, it comes with what? Bacon, egg, sausage, shredded cheese, and four tots. All right, can you hold that camera for me right quick? All right, I'm sorry for the intervention. Thank you for, she's a great camera person. All right, so we go to number 16. Number 16. Give us the same choice. Would you like that as a bacon egg cheese saucer or a sausage egg cheese saucer? Now, when we're doing French toast sticks and center snacks, that is this number right here. Number 17 and 18. It, do it doesn't come with a drink. Okay? Yes. All right, so back again. Thank you, thank you, man. We're gonna make a great camera holder. All right, so we go straight to French toast. It going it don't give us an option or tops or fries or none of that because it doesn't come with it. Okay, and go straight to a drink. Right, and if they want just the entree, just the French toast sticks, it's only four sticks. We don't do a small. We don't do an extra large. Okay, it's just only four sticks. Now with the center snack, it's a little different. You have to ask the question. Yeah, three, two, three, five, All right, got that. Boom. All right. So the next question is on our bacon egg cheese brioche. Some people like to get proper and say brioche, but it's <laughs> brioche. So we have a sausage and and we have the bacon. So okay. we have to press one of those particular choices. Now we go back to Maine. <coughs> Excuse me. Now we have our kids menu. This is our kids menu right here. Okay. Now, kids menu is just like an adult menu, meaning it comes with a side and a drink. Okay. All right. Now, we want to be very particular about rating it up kids meals because it already give us a price. If we stay within the kids meal, meaning a small tot and a small drink, it's gonna be four fifty nine. Okay. Now, our drinks is on what default setting? Medium. So if you hit that, you just charge them a dollar twenty more for bringing up a medium drink. Okay. Now we want to delete that. We don't have to highlight it because what? On the system is showing this is the last thing we run up. Okay. So we just hit item delete and then we go back and make that a mini sprite. And then they're gonna stay within the package. Okay. Okay? So we always make sure we hit mini on the uh the kids meal. Now with chicken we have to ask the question, what? Would you like that with barbecue, honey mustard, or ranch? Boom. We select one. Top surprise. Boom. Mini drink. We stay within the combo. All right. We're going to delete that. So that's our kids' menu. Let's go back to our main menu. And we go to value menu. This is our value menu. It's not a whole lot of options, but that's our value menu. Okay. All right. Now, sometimes we do 50 cent corn dogs, which is next Wednesday. So if a customer, they want five corn dogs, we go to our home screen and see that number pad, okay. we find the number. We hit five and then we hit corn dog. So instead of doing this, True. now we highlight all of this and we're going to hit delete and all of this should come off for us. All right. Now let's go to our drink menu. Now, once again, we said our default setting is medium. So if I press any of these drinks, it's going to ring up medium. Boom. 
So, on uh, we have mini, small, medium, medium large, and Route 44. Now, also, we have our color code for our fountain drinks, our cherry limeades, and our juices. Apple juice, cranberry juice, we no longer serve, serve orange juice. Okay. We discontinue orange juice. Then we have a new drink that we're fixing to uh, serve, which is the Canada Dry. But we also serve cups of ice, bag of ice, bottled water. And then we have our slush menu, our promo drinks. And we're looking at our promo drinks. This is uh, LTOs for this particular month, which is the overload uh, recent glass, Red Bull slushes, and the watermelon Red Bull slushes. And they can buy it in the can, however you like. Go back to Maine. We have, <coughs> excuse me. We have our slushies. Yeah, put that on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here's our slush menu. Now, these are our flavor add-ins right here. Okay. We don't have all of those particular flavors in our drinks. One of the flavors that we don't have is the mango, the raspberry. So how will we ring that up? We have, and then they are in what? They're in alphabetical order. Okay. We have blue coconut, blue raspberry, cherry limeade, cherry cranberry, fountain slush. That's the, when we did the shots. Okay. Remember that? So that's how we will make ring those up. Then we have a limeade. The limeade slush is not on there, but guess what? We have limeade on our okay. uh, screen. We no longer serve watermelon and we discontinue uh, pineapple and green apple. So we don't have green apple, watermelon, pineapple. and pineapple. Okay. We discontinue those flavors. Uh, now, but how would we ring up a mango slush? We would hit the slush and then hit add. And then we will find, we got another page, and then find mango, boom. Now, we also have what type of candy? It's a candy that we offer. We offer Nerds candy. So, Nerds was always on the last page. Why would they put it on the last page? I don't know. Because we sell a lot of Nerds. Nerds should be on the first, first page, it seems like to me. Okay, let's delete that. So, that's our slush menu. And then we're going to go back to Maine. Now, Let's deal with the entrees only, okay? We talked about the burgers. We got a bacon, bacon cheeseburger. That's a single patty. Okay. Anytime you see SS, it's two, patties. two meats and two cheeses. Supersonic bacon, uh, mayo supersonic, a uh, mayo mustard, mayo ketchup, and it works. Now, we have grilled chicken, foot long, corn dogs, medium pop, medium fry, medium top, medium moss, medium onion ring. Now, if a customer asks me for a large top, this is what I do. I will hit medium top and upsize. Okay. Rather than go to size. Now, I can go to size and do a large top, hit large and top. But I just added an extra step. Two. Yeah. Right. So, it's all about quick. How can I bring it up real quick? Because it's all about multitasking, too. All right. So, let's go back to main. Now, we're going to go to breakfast. Now, anytime you hear egg or cheese, anything like that, just... And they're not talking about a combo or just the entree. Then here we have it. We have a bacon uh, egg cheese burrito, sausage burrito, bacon egg cheese toaster, sausage egg cheese toaster, so forth and so on. So this is, uh, is our breakfast menu. And here we will find our white milk. And guess what? We discontinued the chocolate milk. So these two items we don't offer. Chocolate milk, orange juice, and hot cocoa. So let's go back to our main. And then we have chicken slash hot dogs. This is all the chicken that we offer, but without a drink. Okay. Like the crispy chicken, no side, no drink. A dinner without the drink. They can get a three-piece dinner, a five-piece dinner without the drink. Now, they also can get the tenders, three and five. We don't do no four-piece. We don't do a two-piece. These are the sides that we offer, okay? Now, here are our hot dogs right here. We have American dog, a foot long. A six-inch chili cheese dog, a foot long. Uh, Chili cheese dog, a six inch plane, a full on plane. Go back to Maine, and we have other burgers. Now, these are our regular burgers right here, but we have other burgers that we can find. We have a bacon cheeseburger toaster, a BLT, and a chicken club toaster. Okay. Now, on our menu, we don't have a BLT combo, but on from our screen, we can ring up a BLT combo. We hit BLT, and what else do a combo consist of again? Okay, so boom. And then we go here. We're going to say a top, and then we find a drink. And then look at the option that we have on our screen. It says find combo. Boom. So they'll put it in a combo and give them a discount. 
So if a customer is not saying, oh, I want a number one or a number two, but you see where they don't order two burgers, they don't order two sides and two drinks, then you give them what? You give them a discount. Here's an example. We do two burgers, we do two sides, and we do two drinks. But then, not once did they tell you, let me get a number one or a number two. But you see in there, then guess what? I can give them a combo. Now, it was $18.34, we give them a discount, Look how much more it will save them. Ooh. That's a big difference. So we just saved them on this right here. Total saving was four dollars and sixteen cents. So would they want? Why wouldn't they want to come back if we saving them money? True. So we highlight that and we delete it. All right. So let's go to our size. These are our snacks and size right here. So here we have fries. Now, what size you don't see? Medium. Why? Automatic. automatic medium. So we have small fry, medium fry, and large fry. Because that's the default setting of our system. Okay? Now, we delete that off. We have also a pretzel twist. Now, it telling you, you got to choose one. Before you go anywhere, you have to choose one. Okay. Automatically, we just give them the, the dipping sauce. If they want mustard, if they don't want none, they're going to tell you that. Okay? Now, Let's delete that off. Let's go to uh, back to Maine and do frozen. Frozen favorites. My favorite. This deal with all the ice cream. We have shakes, cream slushes, and blasts. Okay. Once again, and these are our Sundays. These are the Sundays that we offer. Caramel, chocolate, hot fudge, and uh, strawberry. But let's do our shakes. Now, these modifiers right here need to be taken off because we no longer do the cream pie. Okay. These are any good. These are cream pie shakes. Now, but here's our regular shake. We got banana, caramel, chocolate, cookie dough, hot fudge, Oreo, peanut butter. Don't do pineapple, strawberry, and vanilla. Okay. There's no pineapples in Sonic franchise. I don't know why they still got it on here. <laughs> okay, now, but here we got the cheesecake. Remember when we talked about the cheesecake uh, flavor and the crumbs. Mm -hmm. Now, if we add Oreos to that, that becomes a Oreo, Oreo cheesecake. cheesecake. Or we take the Oreos out and we add strawberry. strawberry. It becomes what? It's exactly. It's just that simple. Okay. This is very easy what we do. Now, we go back to Maine and we go to the Blast. These are the Blasts that we offer. We don't do Route 44 in Blast. Okay. okay? So we only do what? Mini, small, <laughs> default is medium, yeah. and large. Those are our Blasts that we offer. Cream slushes, whatever flavor that we have in the store, we can make that as a cream slush. We hit the cream slush button and whatever flavor we want to add, okay? Now, let's see. We have a see me button. So let's see what this see me is. Say for instance, we want that burger fresh. A lot of customers say that's what they want. They want it fresh, okay? What well, a lot of people do, they say sweet tea, they want it cut in half. Okay, what is it cut in half for? I'm going to hit see me, and I'm going to tell you what it's, it's cut with. Unsweet. So, the person that's making the drink, don't have to turn around and ask me a question. Hey, what is that drink cut with? I put it on there for you. Okay. You can get a coat. A lot of people, I've seen this happen. People want a coat cut in half with what? Diet coat. So kind of half means like half? Half and half, okay. exactly. Okay. Uh-huh. Now, I'm glad you asked that question. No question is a stupid question. Okay. Okay, you heard that slang, that, that uh -huh. term before? So, whatever question you have, don't hesitate to ask. Okay. Because then you're going to guess at it, and then you can possibly go wrong. And we want to make sure we're doing everything correct. Okay? Now, say for instance, a person say a medium coat. Oh, can you upside that? That was the last thing we rung up. So we don't have to press... Highlight it and then hit upsize. We can upsize all the way up to a route 44. Okay. Tots as well. But guess what? Oh, that's too much. I don't want that. That's too much for my pocket. So we undo. hit undo the upsell. Okay. Now, they have a coupon. Here's our adjust and discount. So our discount is free. Anything that they want free, if they have a coupon, we validate that they have a coupon. If they have a 99 cent coupon, a $199, $299, or other coupon. Okay. Now, uh, we once we find it, we highlight it. So they had a large, it's a large coat. They have a coupon for $0.99. Cent. So 
So we go 99 cent tab, boom. And it says yes. So we just gave him a discount. So it's only a dollar and six cents. Okay. So that's how we do a discount. Now, these uh discount button is also under your tab. Not just because we're under my name, but you can also do that as well. Okay. Let's see. Something that people like to do. We say a, a mayo burger, only cheese and mayo. So um, they're not going to pick pickles, lettuce, onions, or tomatoes, or nothing on it. It's just going to be mayo and cheese only, okay? Let me see the last thing that's on here. Size and extra. Love this one. People like to ask for extra barbecue sauce, buffalo sauce, cider cherry, extra marinara. We're going to put the charge on it. There's a charge for everything. Okay. That's how we charge them. They want a side of bacon, a side of cheese, an extra strip, a side of eggs. I have a customer say, uh, Lenny, can I get a side of toast, a side of cheese, and uh, a side of bacon? You just ask for a bacon and cheese toast. So when I ring up for a bacon and cheese toast, oh, I don't want that. I want it just the way I order it. And that's what I'm going to order. I'm going to ring it up just the way she ordered it. Okay. All right. So let's do a quick test. Okay. And this is the end of our video. Uh, if you have any questions, you know you always speak to your manager. Uh, and if you like it, we ask you to hit the like button and subscribe to this channel. Thank you.